April 28th is the day we remember all those who have lost their lives while working. We say their names out loud because we must acknowledge that they were once here, that their lives mattered. Today, on this day of mourning, we remember those we lost, but we know that their lives were not lost in vain. In the last 50 years, we have made great strides forward in the protection of workers. These laws, along with the tireless advocacy of prevention and education organizations, the passion of health and safety workers and unions, have made Canada a much safer place to live and work. This does not mean, however, that we slow down in our efforts to make workplaces safer and healthier. To the contrary, we let our past successes fuel us to a place where no one has to lose their life to a workplace accident. The unfortunate truth is that while we have made progress, we still have a long road to travel. Even today, on this day of mourning, we know that people will be killed at their workplace. We cannot stop until this stops. We will continue to work hard in areas of education and prevention, reminding people that they have the right to say no to unsafe work that they have the right to participate in making their workplace a healthy and safe place to be. And we will push hard into areas of innovation, believing that we are just one new idea away from creating a healthier and safer Canada. Ultimately, we honour those who have paid the ultimate price of their lives by allowing their memories to catalyze us to create workplace environments that don't just give jobs, but workplaces that give life.